Meister! <laughs> Hey Mayberry Man fans, it's Court Howell here, producer of Mayberry Man, with some great news and another behind the scenes update. We have achieved picture lock, and that means we're done editing and we're moving on to the finishing of the film. That means color, sound, sound effects, the musical score, all that good stuff to make the movie fantastic. Now, we've also been working on plans for the first of our three VIP red carpet screening events in Danville, Indiana, the town where we filmed a lot of the movie and where countless local volunteers and business owners helped us with our production. But there are some things that aren't quite settled, including concerns about COVID and restrictions on indoor gatherings. So we may be looking at postponing the first of our three screenings to a little later in the spring or even summer to make sure it's safe to host the event. After all, we are talking about filling a movie theater with over 200 people, and we want everyone to feel relaxed, comfortable, and safe. Now, in case you haven't heard, Danville is not hosting its annual Mayberry in the Midwest Festival again this year. The uncertainty surrounding COVID restrictions simply made it impossible for them to effectively plan the festival. But when we do host our red carpet event, we hope to have some additional activities that all fans can enjoy. We'll share more about that after we finalize the date for the red carpet screening. Now, for everyone else, it's important for you to understand that Mayberry Man does not have a release date yet, and that means no tickets will be for sale to the general public until we finalize our movie distribution plans and set a date for general release of the movie for the general public. Movie distribution is part of that behind the scenes stuff that most moviegoers don't really think much about. But the reality is, if we start selling tickets and showing the movie on our own in theaters, it could impact impact our chances to get legitimate widespread distribution. And of course, there are millions of Andy Griffith Show fans all over the country, and the world for that matter, and we want them to all be able to enjoy Mayberry Man. And to make that happen, it could take up to a year or more for us to find a distributor and release the film. But remember, if you're a backer, you provided the funds to make the movie, right? So it's no problem for us to screen the movie privately for our financial backers. So if you're a backer at the Ernest T level or higher, which is most people who back the movie, you'll have a chance to see Mayberry Man when we do our pre-release online screening, which was included with your rewards. And if you're not a backer yet, no problem. Anyone can still contribute to the project at supportmayberryman.com. Now, our post-production expenses are mounting, so we are still asking for your help. And anyone who donates to our post-production fund will also receive an invitation to our exclusive pre-release online screening. So you'll be able to sit in the comfort of your own home and enjoy the movie. We'll be announcing a date for the online screening soon, so we'll keep you updated on that. So that does it for this edition of Mayberry Man Behind the Scenes. Until next time, thanks for watching. Thank you.